New at 4.30, family members of a mom of three are raising money for suicide awareness. Stephanie Hollingsworth first went missing in September of last year. Her body was found a month later in a retention pond near a Walmart. New 6's Ezzy Castro has the details on the fundraiser to help others who are contemplating taking their life. It's been more than a year since the death of Stephanie Hollingsworth. She was actually last seen alive here at this Walmart in Goldenrod. Now family members are fundraising to help with suicide awareness. With tears in his eyes, Chad Chitwood remembers the type of person his sister used to be. She was she was involved in a lot of um, activities and was definitely stayed busy and she was a beautiful you know, person, a beautiful soul. It was last year in September that Stephanie Hollingsworth went missing from Belle Isle. Her disappearance sparked a community outreach with friends and family spending weeks searching for her, though her body was found nearly a month later in a pond in Orange County. Investigators ruled her death as a suicide. All the people that came out and pulled together is what led um, to her discovery. Chitwood says it hasn't been an easy year, but they are working to get results. They are now raising money by auctioning this Louis Vuitton purse online. The funds would go to local police departments and other professionals to help with suicide awareness. We wanted to try to figure out how to raise money um, to help support the local police department. Um, Belle Isle, specifically in this, and Orlando uh, Police Department um, were instrumental in um, helping us find her. Bell Isle Police Chief Laura Houston released a statement to News 6 saying the Bell Isle Police Department and the Bell Isle community continue to grieve the loss of Stephanie Hollingsworth. We are committed to helping those struggling with mental illnesses through outreach efforts and advanced crisis intervention training for all our officers. The Hollingsworth family has a special place in all of our hearts. Now, if you wish to help or participate in the auction, we posted the link on our website, clickorlando.com. In Orange County, Ezzy Castro, getting results, News 6.